So I've been working on my sweater number 20 this morning and I'm hoping to have it finished by this weekend. Uh, I'm working on the second sleeve now and I've done about one of uh, the chart repeats. So I think there's about uh, three and a half uh, repeats of the chart I need to do before I get to the ribbing. And then there's about eight centimeters of ribbing. So it's still a little bit to do, but the sleeve goes quite quickly. So I think I'm gonna be able to finish it this weekend. Um, the only problem is I think I'm gonna run out of yarn uh, again, unfortunately, because uh, I had, I think, about 17 balls of the Nepal from Drops and uh, I ran out and I bought two extra balls uh, last week and I thought it's gonna be too much even, but uh, I'm on the last ball now and uh, if I remember correctly, I used a little less than two balls to do this, uh, the first sleeve and now I just used like two uh, like remnant balls that I had used for the collar and for the body but I had left over um, and that wasn't even like half of a ball of yarn so I think it's not going to be enough uh, but we'll see, I'm really crossing my fingers because I would like to not have to buy another ball for this project but uh, if I have to then I have to but um, we'll see so uh, now I just took a break from the sweater and I'm gonna do a little bit of ceramics so I thought I would uh, show you guys what I'm working on with that as well oh and another update uh, tomorrow we are getting a cat uh, I saw this lady's post on a Facebook group uh, she's a Polish lady living in a Hungarian village and she's taking care of all the village cats, she's feeding them and stuff and she's looking uh, to get them homes before it gets cold so I've been talking to her and we decided to take one of the cats uh, so tomorrow we're gonna go meet her and pick up the cat so I'll be sure to introduce you guys to our new cat tomorrow uh, So this room needs a lot of work still um, yeah, here I've been doing the ceramics and I have all my plants there, but uh, I think here on this wall we need like a bunch of shelves because right now um, I don't have anywhere to put the stuff, so it's all still in boxes and yeah, it's a little bit hard to unpack if you don't have anywhere to unpack too. These are some pots that I threw the day before and now I'm going to show you the rest of the process. Uh, so it starts with trimming the bottom of the pot uh, to make it nice and smooth. And then after that I usually sponge down the piece uh, to get rid of any imperfections. And after it can be put into the kiln to be fired for the first time.
Hey guys, uh, just an update. I didn't really finish last week's vlog. It's now the next week, uh, Saturday, and I just wanted to give you guys a little bit, uh, a little bit of an update, just because I kind of left, left it hanging there. So my sweater number twenty. I actually found an extra ball of yarn that was in the storage, which was great. Except it still isn't going to be enough, I think. Uh, right now I'm working on the rib on the last sleeve, so this is like the last part that I need to do. But I have like a very minimal amount of yarn left and the ribbing is like 8 centimeters, so it's it's a pretty big uh, amount that I have to do still. So I'm thinking I need to buy just one more ball of yarn, uh, but that's fine. I'm going into the city on Tuesday and we have the knitting club then. Uh, and there is a yarn shop next to it that sells drops yarn now, so I'm just gonna pick up another ball But it's kind of annoying to just not have enough and I also wanted to update you about our cat I think you can see her here in the back uh, Her name is Lucy or in Hungarian we're also calling her Lutza and She is a super nice super sweet cat. She is so soft. She's so loving. She follows me around the house all the time She's like meowing at me, talking with me, so she's super nice, she's a really nice addition to our family and uh, she's already met our dog as well, who's not living here currently because of the construction. She's living with my boyfriend's mom and she loves it there with her because she has a dog also, so they are best friends. Uh, but we brought them, uh, both of the dogs here a few times to meet Lucy and Lucy took it really well. She one of the reasons why uh, we took her is because uh, we knew that she liked dogs so that was like a high selling point of her for us and it's true she gets along really well with them uh, our dog Sunny is a little bit enthusiastic for her still uh, but they were all sleeping together on the couch yesterday night it was so cute really adorable uh, so yeah, so you're gonna be seeing a lot more of her around here, so I hope you guys don't find the cat content uh, But yeah, uh, I think that's it. I don't think I will film anything else. Uh, I'll definitely make uh, soon uh, a knitting vlog update because I have a bunch of knits that I made in the summer and I haven't even talked about them yet and that definitely needs to happen soon uh, But for now, I hope you guys have uh, a good day. I don't know when I'm gonna post this so uh, take care and talk to you guys later. Bye.